We're going to take a look at this site, Swim University, which is an affiliate site, really kind of an authority niche site. We're going to critique it a little bit. We're going to mention some of the good things and maybe a few things that can be improved. We're going to talk about some of the metrics as well, like the estimated traffic, the domain rating, and more. Now, you can follow the link in the description to get more information about those metrics and the Amazon affiliate program, and that'll be the link over to Niche Site Project. Now, the very cool thing with this website is there's a lot of public information about it. And I can tell you off the bat, the site was created back in December of 2006. It's ranking for about 90,000 keywords, uh, ranking in the top 10. And we'll look at hrefs in a few minutes here. It's getting quite a bit of traffic. And we actually can get um, not just the estimates, but the real traffic because this site was created by Matt Jevanisi and he blogs over at moneylab.co. And in fact, we even know the revenue. So I'm just going to jump to the punchline here. This specific site, it earned about $500,000 in 2021. And the thing is, it's interesting because the traffic has actually had some ups and downs over time. And there have been some ups and downs with Amazon changing their affiliate rate. But because Matt is selling digital products and he's earning money from YouTube, plus he has physical products, he's really made up for the difference in many other areas. So he's earning more than ever because he has taken the brand and grown it in general. So do check out Matt's stuff over here at moneylab.co and you can get more information about the site. So before we hit the actual teardown portion here, I do want to uh, mention some of the stuff over on Href. So this is a search engine marketing tool and generally, it'll help us understand how many keywords the site's ranking for. So about 95,000. There's a lot of backlinks. There's about 4,000 referring domains, and the organic traffic is estimated to be 156,000. If you want to get a little bit more information, you can hop over to Money Lab and see the graphs that Matt provides and that sort of thing. We scroll down and we see the site has had its ups and downs. It looks like the highest sort of traffic was in the middle of 2019, and then it's dipped down a little bit. And you can see the number of keywords ranking here have it's varied quite a bit, and there have been a couple little dips, but it's kind of on an uptick right here. Now, one thing you can do over Ahrefs is get rid of the 11 through 100 that are ranking, and this sort of narrows it down for keywords that the site is actually ranking really well for. So pretty good overall. One thing I could mention is the uh, uh, domain rating and the domain authority are 66 and 51 respectively. And let's just take a look at the homepage here. So we can dive into pool care or hot tub care if we want to. And as we scroll down, we'll see pool care guides here. Uh, very nice branding, custom images. It looks kind of fun. Very, uh, you know, kind of appropriate for this specific niche. And this one is kind of fun, right? We have a smart way to kill algae in your pool quickly and the, the pool water is green. So they, they pay attention to those details. We have the hot tub care guide. So there's uh, more stuff here. And you'll notice down in the bottom, there's a full navigation section here. So you can get wherever you need to, whatever category you need to on the site. Of course, there's a disclaimer for the Amazon Associate Program. And I point out the full navigation in the footer because at the top of the page, it's fairly small and concise. We can search, we can shop, and we can go to pools or hot tubs, which you can get to those two spots there. And there's courses. So you can buy those digital courses and that represents a pretty good chunk of change. But let's dive in and actually look at some of the pool care area. So if we click on pool care, it has basically a, just a list of the posts. So we don't have the featured image. It's just a list of the posts. So you could hop over here and there's a lot of how-to information. This is something the site does really well. The reason why is because Matt worked at a pool care place for many years. That's how the site sort of originated. Matt was a bit of an expert in that area and worked in the marketing area, if I remember right, for uh, 
you know, a, a pool and hot tub care company. So let's take a quick look at maybe how to fix uh, how to fix air in a pool pump. So very specific, and this is something that people would Google. So if we scroll down, we'll see there's a video about it. That's Matt right there. So there's a video about it, and then. There's information specifically that you know Matt is an expert on because he knows the industry. So this is one of those deals where you can't fake it too well. Like you would kind of have to know how to do this. You could do research, but the fact is, if you don't know how to actually solve this problem, if you don't know how to do it, someone's going to see right through it. Someone that has a pool is going to realize that it was written by someone who doesn't know what they're doing. So as we scroll down, it's very, you know, clear, uh, you know, what to do. Check this, check that. There's an affiliate uh, link. This is a, sort of a custom little feature box here. So even though this is a how-to article, there are products that will make this problem go away. You can solve it easier or faster or cheaper by using some of the products that are recommended. So just because it's a how-to article doesn't mean you can't recommend products. In fact, it's kind of your job to recommend the products that help people solve the problem. As we scroll down, we see more information, more products. There was another video. You actually have little ads in here. So this is a little ad for some of Matt's own products. So the thing is, you know if someone is searching for how to deal with air in a pool pump, they have a pool, all right? No one is searching for that if they don't have a pool. So if they have a pool, they might want to get this little pool care handbook. And basically it says, the promise is you'll save $100 right away. So a couple great things that Matt has done here. One is a how-to article and he's recommending affiliate products. The second thing, He is putting ads for his own products. He's earning so much more money from selling his own digital products versus recommending a physical product. So this is perfect. He knows that the person owns a pool. They are trying to solve a problem and who doesn't want to save $100 right now on pool care? I don't have a pool. I never have. I suspect I would want to save money and I would realize that saving $100 $100 would be an awesome thing. So as we scroll down, we see a little bio box. So that's something that has been missing in some of the other sites that I've reviewed in the past. And it tells you that Matt has worked in the pool and spa industry since 1995. Lending, expertise and authority. And there's a picture which adds more trust. You can join the email list here. Another great thing. If you want to sell your own products, it's great to have an email list so that you can contact people directly. And if they are on this site, again, you know they have a pool, they want to get a a cheat sheet. Yes. And it looks kind of cool. It tells you some things to do. It's branded uh, very nicely. It looks like an infographic. The other thing that Matt has is other recommended guides, which are related. There's not too many of them though. Sometimes people put like way too many options and it gets a little confusing, but there's just four and this is perfect. It's more things about a pool pump. So there's one about a pool pump. There's another one about a pool pump. And then the others are kind of related, but not as directly. So if you dig these teardowns, please do leave a comment. Let me know if you have any questions. In fact, if you have questions specifically on this site, feel free to ask here. If you dig these reviews and teardowns of websites, please check out some other stuff on the channel. I have several other teardowns. You can go to Niche Site Project. There's a link in the description. If you sign up for the email list over there, I will send you my systems and templates. Uh, They're about writing content, hiring writers, all the things that I use. There's even a template for how to put together a best of guide or something like that. All sorts of different helpful items that you can get to. So please check it out and I'll catch you on the next teardown.